Alright, I'm just being silly right now, but guess what I just got sent to me? Ah, a huge box. I'm trying to hide my address from you guys in case some of you are creepy stalkers. <laughs> That's my awkward laugh. Um, got this a week ago. And of course, I have not had time to open it and show it to you guys. So I decided to show it to you guys today. Lots of stuff in here. Um, so, if you guys are as obsessed with maxi dresses as I am, then you would know that Outlook had an awesome sale. Most of them were very, very cheap, around the $20 range or less. So, you know what? I went out and I bought different colors and different styles and I am so excited to share it. Alright, so first thing I got is like a color block. I probably should take it out of the baggie thingy. These hangers like poked. You know what? I don't know why I even kept it in this because I know that I'm probably not going to like maintain that. I'll just throw them around as I wear them. It is a racer back and the brand is Love Appella. Love Appella. L-O-V-E-A-P-P-E-L-L-A. -E -L -L -A. And it has like a color blocking. I just love this. I think it also came in like gray and pink, but I just thought this is more striking of a maxi dress. And since I am only 5'1", what I usually do is try to look for maxi dresses that are cotton based. Anything that feels like cotton and maybe like a little mixture of spandex is okay, but um, anything that's that material, it's so easy to just cut it and make it fit you. So that's why I got this. And especially the color blocking, you can probably cut like some of the bottom of it off and it doesn't look too weird because it'll just like a, look like an initial thin lining of the white or whatever because I know that every maxi dress that I wear or buy I have to cut because I'm always too short for it. Even in heels I'm way too short for it. Maxi dresses are not designed for us short girls I guess but I don't care. I like it so I'm gonna wear it. Um, another one I got I think it's similar to it but it's just not color blocked. Oh actually it's not. It's a thicker strap. The other one was spaghetti strap and this one is more of like a tank um, wife beater dress or whatever strap and is this a high low one? No, it's not a high low one. It's just a long one. It's crazy bright magenta color. Okay. And then got it in gray also. So it's just like a light gray color. Definitely different from what I usually have. Oh, this one has a little bit cinching. Oh, this is a high-low one. I didn't realize that. It has like this little opening right here. I think it's super cute. I can't wait to try it on. And it's like a high-low dress. Little waist cinching. I think it would look awesome if I had like a pretty belt to cinch around this little um, waistband thing. So. I just love this color. It's just like a pearly, pretty gray color. And then another one is this. Oh, yeah, I feel like they sent me the same thing twice. I'm pretty sure I didn't order it twice. I'm kind of confused right now. Weird. It's kind of odd. <laughs> it's like the same thing. I don't know why they did that. I might have to like look at my receipt and make sure I don't get charged twice for something I didn't order twice. That's weird. Alright, another one. Ooh. Actually, I have one that I wore already. I have to go upstairs and grab it in a bit. It is a more of like a gray bluish color. So pretty. And it's long. So I can basically just cut this bottom part a little bit to make it my height. And um, this one actually got separately, and I think it might be a different brand. 
Oh, this one is a Rachel Polly dress. It is gorgeous. I hate these little clear things. Some of you guys hate these little clear things. Like, they're meant to assist you in hanging the dress. But I feel like whenever I wear it, it always sticks out and I look stupid most of the time. And it is a U-back. I think this dress is a lot pricier than the other ones. It's at least, like, $80 or something like that. Or $90 or $100. I'm not sure how much. But this dress was lovely on the model and it just looked beautiful. It has like a back tie, but then it has like a U-back. So you tie like lower than the U-back. I don't know if you guys can see, it's just so pretty. And it goes all the way down to the floor like a max, every other maxi dress. But I just love, oh gosh, I just can stare at this for hours. The front and the back, it looks like a princess dress. That's what it looks like to me, it's just unique. I'm always looking for just unique like maxi dresses that I can wear because it, it looks like you're dressed up. Like, it looks like you tried so hard to put your outfit together, but basically all you did was, like, put on underwear and whipped on a dress, and, like, bam, it looks like you tried. So, that's why I like wearing it. It's very comfortable, and I don't have to worry about if I sit, like, is my dress too short or whatever, you know what I mean? So, that's why I like it. And this one I actually got elsewhere. I got it at, um... What the name is? Arden B. Yeah, this is an Arden B one, and it was thirty dollars. And I just love the back of this. It just has these straps, and then the front straps are doubled. So you can see, it's very unique. Um, it's like a corally reddish color. Just love it. I'll be right back with other dress. All right, so I just got the last one that I got from Outlook. And it's the same Love Appella brand, which is with that kind of racer back look. And it's red, and I don't have anything like this, so I think it would look awesome. And that is basically my maxi dress haul. I mean, I got a lot of, like, the maxi look, I guess, so there's not really much to talk about. Other than, if you are interested in Outlook, um, I'll just link it below. And I love it. I've honestly been using it for, like, two, three years now, and it's like an online TJ Maxx Marshalls, so that's why I love it so much. But you know what? I always miss, like, the really, really, really good sales. Like, I've seen, like, Christian Louboutin on it, and I always miss it for some reason. Because I would see it, and it sold out. So, if Chanel or Christian Louboutin or anyone awesome, like, free people maybe even, sell stuff on there, tell me, because I feel like no one tells me. They always just go and like get for themselves like sneakily. So yeah, I would love if someone just gave me a heads up like, hey, in two days, there's gonna be this sale, like come to it. So yeah, um, and if you don't know about Outlook yet, um, it's basically just an exclusive site where they sell um, designer brand stuff for cheaper. And you can't like, if this stuff, I bought it like a couple weeks ago before it was sent to me, so it's, one of those things where you can't see what I got and then get the exact same thing because you have to wait for the events to come up at a certain date and then you they expire like after 36 hours or whatever. So it's one of those things where you have to wait for the event to come on sale and then buy it. So yeah, in case you have any questions about the Outlook stuff. And I think that is it for my haul. I hope you guys like it and hope you guys enjoy hearing from me and um, I miss you guys. I actually moved to a new apartment. This is a little bit of a view. So, yeah, and I actually moved to a different state, too. I haven't really gotten a chance to, like, talk to you guys about my life and what's going on. So, um, my boyfriend and I basically are living together now, and we're living in Indiana. So, if you see me, don't be scared to say hi. I actually met, like, quite a few people um, who have come up and said hi to me. So, it's awesome. But, yeah. I will maybe give you guys like a house tour, but I feel like everything is just in disarray right now. Like nothing is put together or decorated. We just basically moved here. It's been like a month or two months and it's just nothing is completed and God knows how long we're going to live here for before we like move somewhere else or whatever. So I'm not sure if it's going to ever be done decorated, but maybe I'll just give you like a preview of what I have now and stuff, which is not that much. So I feel like I would bore you guys, but if you're interested, comment below or tweet me or Facebook me 
probably either Facebook me or tweet me or Instagram me because I feel like I would see that more. I try to read the comments as much as I can, but I've been really, really busy. So yeah, um, any kind of like direct connection is probably easier. But that is it. I hope you guys enjoy this video and I will see y'all next time. Love you all.